Hello cookbook friends, let's look through Home is Where the Eggs Are by Molly Ye. I had this sitting on my counter uh, while my friends were over for the holidays. And one of my friends was like, oh, I had no idea she had a cookbook. And I was like, well, she does. She was so excited. So she actually went out and go went and bought her cookbook just because she just wanted it. She loves eggs. And I mean, I love eggs too. So let's look at the table of contents. I don't think this is explicitly or just Saw just only eggs. I think there's more than eggs. There are 120 recipes in here. Let's look through it. I'm excited and I like that there's no shine on it. Perfect. So holy moly, there's a lot of recipes. So she's listed out all the recipes in the table of contents, including the page numbers. So if you're stuck, you can at least find something. There's eggs, salads, pastas, pizzas, sweets, hot dishes, family style, snacks, breads, handheld soups. All right, that's a lot and it's amazing. This is, this does have a lot of photos, but it's not super crazy photo heavy. There's a lot of text. You get to learn more about Molly and her life on the farmhouse. So let's break this down. We have crusty chocolate chip bread. That looks awesome. Who doesn't love chocolate chips and bread together? This is a bacon waffle recipe, a classic. Cream cheese scrambled eggs. I'm sure this is probably better than it sounds, especially if you just whip it all together. It's probably really creamy and good. So she has a large text here describing the dish, kind of how you can present the dish and other sides you can serve with it. Here's the dish itself, the ingredients with the serving size. And then here's how you put together the dish. And a lot of this is pretty easy. Um, there are some dishes that have more elaborate step-by-steps but or directions, but it's not, it's not crazy for the most part. So here is a feta and za'atar omelet roll-up. That sounds really good. Mozzarella stick salad. Who doesn't love this idea? If I could put mozzarella sticks in a salad, that's awesome. Here is some other salads being showcased here. Tahini chicken salad. She is a little, she is a little wordy. She likes to talk a lot. So I think the directions as well can be a little wordy because she's very, very, very specific. Here's sheet pan roasted squash soup. Cute. Oh, Pizza Friday, so different shapes and uh, faces you can put on your pasta if you're, especially if there's kids around. Salami and arugula pasta, that is also another classic. So yeah, there's not just eggs in here. Here is uh, hand pulled noodles with pot sticker pillow or filling sauce. Yum. With step by step photos, skillet rice and romp ri ramp rice and bok choy. Wow. Farrow bowls with poached eggs and green tahini. So like I said, not a lot of photos, but enough, I would say, especially if you are comfortable. She doesn't, she has been featured on the Food Network before. You're probably familiar with her cooking style. And I like that we do get a book now from her. This is Kale G. Deneria Melts. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I, I butchered that. We do have desserts in here, and um, let's see if I can find some. We have bread. I'm not sure if I can find them. Pine nut blondies, yummy. And we have different kinds of brownies and uh, blondies, and a plum. This is called a kuchen, which looks beautiful. Check this out. Um, if you you probably are familiar here with Molly Ye for the most part, she does have a lot of cool recipes in here, and that's probably why you don't need as many um, pictures because we've seen it on the Food Network before. But this is great for all weekday and weekend night nights, all that kind of stuff. Dishes you can prepare. So his home is where the eggs are. If you're looking for more cookbooks, make sure to join us on our socials at Cookbook Divas and our Amazon Live channel at cook or amazon.com slash live slash cookbook divas we'd love to see you over there make sure to comment and subscribe if you do like cookbooks and make sure to let us know what cookbook you want us to feature next time